Hello everyone, welcome uh, to watching me hunt for fossils. I really appreciate you tuning in and uh, watching this. I really enjoy doing this. So um, at some point during the, uh, the video, if you want to subscribe, please do. That way you can know about future videos and so forth. But um, generally I like to start the show off uh, telling you where I'm at and kind of where, what I'm doing. And So I'm at the NSR again. And um, you know, it's we had a real heavy rainstorm. We didn't get a whole lot out of that. Um, so I came back to the spot that I've hunted before just to see what I could find and found a few pieces of bone, little things, a couple little small gastropods. Um, so I apologize for the wind, as you can tell it's very windy out here today. And, um, but I did find a, a nice uh, vertebrae, so I'm going to spin this around and uh, that'll be the first find that we'll put on camera today. So there it is, that's the uh, vertebrae that I just found. That's uh, beat up, like always. It'd be nice to find one that's not completely beat up. I've got a couple of them. But uh, just sitting here on top, check out all this matrix to go through. Yeah, it's going to take me a little bit of time to get through it all. But um, as I bend down and take a look, there's actually a small piece of bone right there. Um, yeah, talk about beat up. That's definitely beat up. So we're going to keep looking, hopefully find some poor, some cool stuff, and uh, hopefully uh, be able to show it to you. So... Let's go find some fossils. Well, so uh, we're still in about the same area as you can tell, just uh, looking around, got closer to the water this time, and uh, I don't know if you can see it. So, take a look. See if you can see what I see. If you said this right here, you'd be right. That's a bone. Well, chunk of a bone. I think I have one that looks just like that already, but uh, Nice to find. We're going to keep looking. Uh, still have a long way to go, too. A lot of stuff to look through. All righty. We got a twofer here. So, got this piece of bone right here. Wow. How cool is that? No idea what that is from. No clue whatsoever. I'm going to have to speculate and say turtle. Um, but I'm not really sure. And then... Right here is another chunk of, I believe, bone. Yeah, that's another piece of big bone there. Once again, that one is beat up. But look, well, so it's part of the back of something. Because look, this looks, maybe that's a rib or something. Maybe, I don't know. See, the, the marrow, it's actually calcified. The uh, middle of the bone there, which is pretty cool. Hold on, let's see what we got here. And, uh, nope, that's a rock. So that's not going to do us any good, so we'll put that back. But that's pretty cool. Found two right there in the same spot, so we're going to keep looking. So I was right there uh, when I found those two bones in the, the rock. So, and then I came across here, and I believe we've got a good-sized chunk of a tooth here. Yep. That's a good piece of a tooth. I cannot pronounce the name of the fish that, that came from, but I will uh, see if I can remember to put it in the video. Maybe provide a link at some point to have you be able to go look at it. But, I mean, think of the fish that that thing was in. Let's see what else we can find. So it's been a little slow since uh, the last um, fossils I found, the, the, the tooth. And uh, so there is something here, though. So I'm going to scan. Let's see if we can find it. If you guys haven't noticed, it kind of should be pretty easy to spot, actually. So, it's right here. We got a bone right here. Ah, what is that? You know, this, I wonder if all this is turtle I'm finding. Because this, you know, maybe a piece of the shell. I mean, not the shell, the carapace underneath the shell. Huh, I'll have to find out. It's pretty cool if you can see how the lines go this way and then that way. Pretty neat. All right, we're going to keep looking. Well, uh, I'm on the other side of the bridge now. Um, decided to come down here. Didn't see anybody hunting down here. Um, and it paid off. I already moved it because I wasn't sure what it was. Whoops, let me get out of the sun there. But check out this vertebrae. Wow, how cool is that? 
Ha! That's a uh, pretty good size. That is so cool. Well, now I'm really pumped up. I'm going to keep looking through this area. Hopefully, we can find some more. Hey everyone, thanks for uh, watching the video. I'm going to go ahead and do a recap. Uh, we had a great day out there at the North Sulphur River. Um, thank you for watching. Would appreciate your subscription if you're willing to do it. Just hit the subscribe button there at the bottom right at the end of the video. Uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. But let's get started here. As you can tell, we had a good day with gastropods. Got quite the collection there. Um, so, whoops, that one kind of fell over. Let's flip him back over. They're all in really good shape, too. I mean, it, Considering they've been through the river and so forth, um, nothing wrong with any of these. Glad to add them to my collection. Um, then I have this uh, Baculite piece right here. Um, I kept this one because it's rather large and it's got both ends to where you can see what actually attached is kind of a piece of one. But it's really heavy, so I think it might be a pyrite um, fossil, but um, we're going to have to take a look at that. And um, there's that one tooth that I did find. That's the only tooth I found for the day. Um, then I found these little guys right here. They're covered with calcite. They're interesting. Um, really hard material here, um, like cement. And then uh, found two of them, and I've never seen those before there in that area. Um, thought they were pretty cool looking. I picked them up just to, just to have them, really. Um, then we did find some pyrite, actually. Check out the pattern on that guy right there. It's uh, It broke on me a little bit, but um, I'll probably glue it back together. But it's got some cool design to it and I'll go ahead and uh, clean that up a little bit more and there was just another piece of pyrite right there got some shine to it a little bit of glitter uh, let's check the other there you go there's a little bit more glitter to it um, so there's a layer of the um, matrix that there's just a gap just a little gap this stuff apparently uh, is inside of there and it comes out every now and then this is a part of a rudest clam these things get rather large they sit in the ground like that actually and uh, they can get up to like two feet long, I think it is, or 18 inches. So then uh, go to the ammonite pieces. A lot of good um, floral powder, patterns on those, suture lines. Um, just some really nice ones. Whoops, got some, some good ones there. And there's another piece right there. And another piece. And another piece. This one's kind of cool. It's kind of uh, compact, but on the other side it's got some... Uh, a lot of little oyster pieces to it, so that's going to clean up rather nice. And then we got a large piece right here. Um, love the suture pattern on that one. Shows up really well. And so was a day of bones, and uh, I got a lot of bones. There's a rib bone, piece of a jaw there, another piece of a jaw. Just some, uh, lots of cool stuff. A lot of bones. Very few of them. There's that one of them. You drew a blank there for a second. <laughs> There's that one vertebrae. And this is a small vertebrae that I happen to find. Uh, it's beat up on both sides, but you can tell it's got the ends to it. And there's another piece of a vertebrae here. Um, and there was uh, this piece right here, which I thought was kind of cool looking also. Um, but then, you know, there was a piece that I said I thought was part of a turtle. And the reason I think that is because if you look at this piece I found in one of my other videos, those two look pretty similar to each other, don't they? So, I'm going to assume that's part of a, uh, a turtle bone. Um, and then you have uh, just some miscellaneous bones. I have no idea what this is. Cool looking. Um, you know, imagination goes wild, of course, what it might be. And then some other another piece there. This is the piece that actually, right here, that you can see right there in the middle, I told you it has some calcite in it. Let me see if I can get that to zoom, get a little bit better focus for you. Um, well, we're not going to do too well there. Ah, there we go. A little bit better. That's a nice chunk of bone also. Remember, this one's found actually right next to this one, or within a, just a couple feet of this one. So I'm going to assume it's probably from a, a turtle also. And then uh, we have, um, this is the uh, find of the day. This is a very nice vertebrae. This is from a mosasaur. Um, I'm going to be able to clean this inner side up and get that to where you'll be able to see through it. But that is a really nice piece. Well, thank you for watching. I really enjoyed uh, sharing my adventures with you. Look forward to uh, another adventure next time. See you then.